Scoring lives 16 and 16 begins in Second City, home of the Hurricanes. You know, for the last several years, people have been wondering when is Kapolei finally going to break through in the OIA? Well, if there's ever a time to do it, it's this year. After acquiring some much needed pieces offensively this summer, the teal and the black have a revitalized swagger as they enter the fall. That, combined with the defense ready to explode, could be the formula for the Hurricanes to finally storm their way to an OIA title. This is Kapolei. And this is 16 in 16. Well, the summertime grind continues for the Hurricanes, a physical and mental test in preparation for a gauntlet in the OIA. And leading the charge, one of the state's highly touted recruits, center, Sean Owai. Practice has been going well. We've been working hard. As you can see, we got hell, hell workout, you know, out here in the hot sun, weight training, stations, kind of like CrossFit, but just more, more of the weights getting, getting bigger and quicker as well. But yeah, we work out hard five days a week, so we're always getting it. The guy is, you know, he's, he's a one of a kind type of player. You know, he's fast, he's quick. We're expecting him to be a leader, but not just on the offensive line. We expect him to take his leadership level to the, to the next level. Uh, you know, I just, want, I just want the offensive line as a whole, you know, just be quick off the ball, get back, get the next play in, and just basically dominate and work on our, we're working on our communication as we, as we get towards the season, just so all the offensive linemen can click and we can get together and just dominate. After years of an option style set, look for the Canes to spread it out a bit more this season with new weapons to utilize. Former Campbell receivers Alika Bantelina and Boogie Tongo Sue hop on board, along with former Sabre slinger Ezra Savea. The junior, who played his freshman ball at Kapolei, returns home, adjusting to a new team with a new offense. If you compare them, like it's like a big difference. Campbell, it was like a little bit relaxed, but at the same time, it was a no, um, no huddle. Over here is like is a fast pace and going tempo, because we want to catch the defense off guard. The hardest part um, over the summer was basically like getting my um, speed up and like moving, have, having a faster tempo with football, and just learning, still learning how to be a leader. Just a lot of a lot of talent, a great skill set. Uh, he reminds me of a young Randall Cunningham, really, the way he runs, the way he moves. Um, Obviously, uh, this year he's more mature than he was last year. Uh, Josh Kansana last season was the star of the JV as a freshman, so we pulled him up this year as a sophomore on the varsity, and uh, the guy has all the tools. He's speed, uh, he has hands, uh, he has another gear. When he gets into the open, uh, he's a home run threat, so he, he gives us another dimension at running back, so we're excited about him. Defensively, Kapolei will line up in multiple three- and four-man fronts. But the big question mark could be its linebacking core. With the loss of Ronald Matatia to graduation, returning Omar Moreco, stud sophomore Rocky Savea, and a slew of others will look to carry the load this season. We have some hybrid players that can do both, like Johnny Morrison, who can play with his hand in the dirt. Last year, he had nine sacks, 12 tackles for loss. Uh, he's, he's got bigger and stronger, so we expect big things from him. On the D-line, uh, Punahou Mahilona is going to anchor the D-line again as, as a nose tackle. So. We just want to prove people wrong. Always doubting us, like saying like we, we aren't up there yet, we're not good enough. We're just ready to show it's our time. Time that can't pass by fast enough as Kapolei looks to achieve their ultimate goal. Oh, we want to win every game we can. You know, we, we believe we can, so we're just going to push and hope for the best. I think it's like every other high school is going, going to see, see championship, but we're working towards there. Every, every, every game, we got to get better and execute and stay together as one. Is this the year the Hurricanes finally claim the crown? Kapolei begins their season August 7th, a home game versus Kaiser. Felipe Ojastro, ScoringLive.com.